guys take care of it. <laughs> A girlish crush turned to gnawing obsession. Born in Chicago, Ruth Ann Steinhagen was a lifelong Cubs fan. But when she went to Wrigley Field, her focus wasn't on the team as a whole, but rather one player, Eddie Waitkiss. Without her frequent glimpse of Waitkiss, Ruth's fixation ripened into festering obsession. The next... flickering light, Ruth nurtured her ravenous devotion. But her feelings for Waitkiss, once just a potent affection, became desperate and greedy. And soon she began to contemplate another fate for her beloved. She decided that Eddie Waitkiss had to go. Because if she could not have him, no one else could. And that includes the Philadelphia Phillies. All she needed was a gun. Ruth checked into the Edgewater Beach Hotel on the night of June 14, 1949, under the surname Burns. The hotel was a popular spot for ball players. She prepared to ensnare Waitkiss with a mysterious invitation. It's extremely important that I see you as soon as possible. We're not acquainted, but I have something of importance to speak to you about. My name is Ruth Ann Burns, and I'm in room 1297A. I'd rather not talk about it on the telephone. Would he come up to the room, please? Okay, Miss Burns, I'll send him to your room. Thank you. Surprisingly, Eddie had taken the bait, despite Ruth being a total stranger to him. Come on in. Have a seat. I've got a surprise for you. She walked to the closet door and pulled out a 22, a rifle. Pulls out the rifle. He comes out with this long rifle. And she said, You're not going to bother me anymore. She tried to do it. And that was all he kept thinking. And with that, she gets up, rushes out in the hall, and says, I killed him! I just shot Eddie Wayton! And she's very upset because she gets no attention. Do you hear me? I just shot Eddie Wayton! Ruth Steinhagen would have to answer for her sins. She was arrested for the deranged shooting of the baseball star. And she was spared a murder charge when Eddie miraculously recovered. 